Hi, it's That Gratitude Guy with a special video today. I found this article recently and I thought it was very well worth sharing. It's entitled, My Generation is Blind to the Prosperity Around Us by Alyssa Algren. She writes, I'm sitting in a small coffee shop near Lake Nokomomas, I think in Minneapolis, trying to think of what to write about. I scroll through my news feed on my phone looking at the latest headlines of Democratic candidates calling for policies to quote unquote fix the so-called injustices of capitalism. I put my phone down and continue to look around. I see people talking freely, working on their MacBooks, ordering food they get in an instant, seeing cars go by outside, and it dawned on me. We live in the most privileged time in the most prosperous nation and we become completely blind to its vehicles, food, technology, freedom to associate with whom we choose. These are things that are so ingrained in our American way of life, we don't give them a second thought. We are so well off here in the United States that our poverty line begins 31 times above the global average, 31 times. Virtually no one in the United States is considered poor by global standards, yet in a time where we can order a product off Amazon with one click and have it on our doorstep the next day, we are unappreciative, unsatisfied, and ungrateful. Our unappreciation is evident as the popularity of socialist policies among my generation continues to grow. Democratic Congressman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez recently said to Newsweek talking about the millennial generation, quote, an entire generation, which has now become one of the largest electorates in America, came of age and never saw American prosperity, end quote. Never saw American prosperity? Let that sink in. When I first read that statement, I thought to myself, that was quite literally the most entitled and factually illiterate thing I've ever heard in my 26 years on this earth. Many young people agree with her, which is entirely misguided. My generation is being indoctrinated by a mainstream narrative to actually believe we have never seen prosperity. I know this firsthand. I went to college. Let's just say I didn't have the popular opinion, but I digress. Why then, with all of the overwhelming evidence around us, evidence that I can see, even see sitting at a coffee shop, do we not view this as prosperity? We have people who are dying to get into our country, people around the world destitute and truly impoverished, yet we have a young generation convinced they've never seen prosperity, and as a result, elect politicians dead set on taking steps towards abolishing capitalism. Why, why, why? The answer is this. My generation has only seen prosperity. We have no contrast. We didn't live in the Great Depression or live through two world wars, the Korean War, the Vietnam War, or see the rise and fall of socialism and communism. We don't know what it's like to live without the internet, without cars, without smartphones. We don't have a lack of prosperity problem. We have an entitlement problem an ungratefulness problem, and it's spreading like a plague. So if you like videos like this and videos about gratitude and its power, please hit the subscribe button in the lower right-hand corner and click on the bell to get a notification of every time I send out a new video. I'm that gratitude guy. Remember, be grateful and never quit.